Hi, Dr. Eric Desmond here. Today we're going to talk about liposuction and in particular safe lipo liposuction. Now, in general, liposuction is a procedure performed to contour the body and remove fat. And then after the fat is removed, we have the skin tighten up over the area to help change the contour and give a great result. Now, there are a variety of different techniques available for liposuction, but all of them have some things in common. Generally, for most liposuction procedures today, it's going to start with the infiltration or infusion of some fluid into the area where we're going to suck the fat out, and that's called a tumescent technique or a wet technique or a super wet technique. There's some slight variations, but they all have the same concept of injecting some fluid that has epinephrine or adrenaline uh, in it, as well as some uh, local anesthesia, some lidocaine typically. And that's going to cause the blood vessels around the fat to constrict, and it's going to give some extra pain relief from the procedure itself. By causing the blood vessels to constrict, it, has, it leads us to have less blood loss with the procedure itself. So after that fluid is injected, then some form of procedure is done where the fat gets sucked out. Traditional, original liposuction just had a hollow tube that was connected to a suction machine, and after the fluid was put in, the fat would get sucked out. And that's kind of the most basic form of liposuction technique. There have been other techniques that have been, been developed over the years where first the fluid is put in, and then an ultrasonic probe, for example, is placed into the fat, and the fat gets broken up by the ultrasonic probe, or a laser is put underneath the skin into the fat, and the fat's broken up by the laser. And both of these techniques are effective. You can then go suck the fat out after the laser or the ultrasonic probe has been used, and it can, however, cause some firm scarring or even burns to the skin. So Safe Lipo was really developed to address some of those concerns as well as to be used in situations where liposuction has to be revised or redone in those areas that previously have had uh, been treated with uh, the laser or ultrasonic uh, treatment. And so the Safe Lipo technique is really um, a refinement that has three separate parts. And the, the term safe lipo implies safety, but it also is an acronym and the S stands for separation. So the first phase of the technique is a separation phase. The A in safe stands for aspiration. And then the third phase is the letters FE for fat equalization. So the first phase, a probe is used to separate the fat and basically break up the fat. And that's done separately from the aspiration phase where a separate probe is used and the fat is actually sucked out. And then the third and final phase is the fat equalization phase where basically internal micrografting of fat is being done to help smooth things out. So the benefits of Safe Lipo are that you don't impart energy into the tissue, so there's no risk of burns you're able to have more predictable and faster recovery from the surgery, and it can be done in areas that have been previously treated with ultrasound or laser treatments. So Safe Lipo is a great technique to give great results in folks who've never had liposuction before, as well as folks who need revision liposuction, where they've already had energy imparted into those tissues, and there are problems or issues with some scar tissue or contour irregularities. So I hope this answers questions about Safe Lipo. Give us a call if you have any questions and want to get set up for an appointment, 703-924-3144, or visit us on the web at vcps.com. And if you enjoyed this video, please share it with a friend and give us a like. Thanks a lot. Thank you.